Yo, what's up, cool guys? Back with another video. This video, I'll be going over the celebrities took the oath. Oh no, oh, they took it. Most of these celebrities, especially the A class celebrities, most of these celebrities took the oath. What do I mean by the oath? The contract with Satan sold their soul to the devil. They they took the oath. And look, let me let me just go off of scripture. In Mark chapter eight, verse thirty six to thirty seven says, for what shall it profit a man if he shall gain the whole world and lose his own soul? Or what shall a man give it in exchange for his soul? So giving in exchange, because they the devil tried um making Jesus, tried making Jesus Christ sell his soul. He tried making him sell his soul, saying if thou bow down and worship me, then thou you get all these kingdoms or something. But he 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 is like resist the devil. And then uh, he was resisting the devil, so he wasn't giving in, and he fought back with the word of God. The, the, the devil eventually had to flee. So the devil had to flee, because like, cause the devil was like, oh, he's too strong. I, I, he's too strong. I can't, can't get him. Gotta go, to, go find someone who's who's more weaker. So he, he just flees and goes on to the next person. So, For what shall it profit a man if he shall gain the whole world and lose his soul? Giving exchange for your soul. The celebrities... Most of these celebrities, they, they exchanged their soul. They exchanged their soul. So they can have all this same, all this glory, but it's all vain. It's not worth it. Because at the end of the day, when we all get judged, they, 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 are, they already lost their soul because they sold it. They sold their soul. They sold their soul to the devil. So it's not worth it because 85 years of fame and glory and then being in hell for an eternity, it's just not worth it. Most of these celebrities, their job to do is, um, they're following their handler, Satan. Their job to do is to drag you to hell, these celebrities. And I'm not part of the matrix, so I'm not focused on like, what celebrities are doing or what they're doing. I'm just focusing on myself. I'm trying to better my spirit, better myself. And you guys should do the same too, which means um, prayer, reading the word, maybe fasting if you if you want. So fasting is not a salvation requirement, but it, it can't help. But if you want to do it, if you, if you, if you. anyway, and that's our weapons. Oh yeah, those are our weapons. What I just said, the the fasting, the prayer, um, by the word of God, Bible. But Satan also has his Satan also has his weapons. His children of Satan, devils. He has his minions and he has his people. He can use people. We don't wrestle against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rules of darkness of this world. And spiritual wickedness in high places. Ephesians chapter 6 verse 12. So we don't wrestle against flesh and blood. When you're going back and forth with a person, you're not, you're, it's, you're not, you might think you're going back and forth with a person, but you're actually going back and forth with a demon, demon of strife, trying to drain you of your energy. And when your energy gets drained, now you don't have the energy to worship God, to, to, to pray, to, to read the word, to do, to do those stuff, because that's the whole goal of the enemy. The goal of the enemy, the goal of the enemy with the demon strife, he tries to drain you of your energy so you won't be able to have energy to, to do God's will. So you gotta be just, be careful who you give your energy to. Who you, who you like, I wouldn't, like, for me, um, I just, when someone's saying something, like, they, I felt like, you just feel it, you know, like, you're, it's like your spidey senses are tingling. You just know that that guy's just, that guy, this guy is just trying to make me debate with him. So if I go, if I give it in, if I, or like, this guy's trying to make me argue with him, but if I give it in, then my energy will be drained. So the best thing to do is to walk away. Is to walk away. Because the, if you want to win an argument, all you gotta do is just walk away. Just walk away. That's how you win. Just walk away. Because the demons hate it when you ignore them. How Mark the Messenger said it. And he, he, I was one of his videos and he left it right, 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 right there. Right there. Right, but that, that's where he left in his video. So like, the demons hate it when you, demons hate it. They hate it when you ignore them. They hate it when you ignore them. So that's why you gotta ignore these demons who are trying to debate or trying to drain you of your energy argue. And the best thing to do is just, just keep silent and keep moving forward. Keep pushing, keep pushing, keep moving forward. Keep advancing the kingdom of God. And um, so these celebrities took the oath. Most of these celebrities. You guys gotta stop watching the celebrities. Don't be of this world. And um, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.